Hey guys, it's Scott Krug with New England Low Vision and I just wanted to uh, let you know about this product that I have on my head right now. It's called eSight. Now eSight has been very good at marketing their product. You may have seen it advertised on many periodicals, even on TV. And it's an amazing product. It has come down in price over the years and it has increased in quality as well, so that's nice. It was around 15,000 at its start. Then some of you remember at 10,000, now it's uh, just about $5,000. Um, so the eSight is a very thin wearable device. And what you're seeing now is me having the whole product up above my eyes. Uh, we call that the pantoscopic tilt. So you can raise it like a visor and you can use it for walking around, which I'll demonstrate in a second. But I wanted to show you the wire that comes with it. Uh, some of the devices that we are showing have a wire. Other devices that we are showing do not have a wire. This one, of course, has a wire. And it's nice because you reduce a lot of the weight on your head. It has a little uh, rubber gripper up here on my forehead, if the camera can get in on that. And so when you put this on, you just make sure that rubber gripper is in the right spot so that it's lifting this nose piece just above your nose. And then it almost feels like you don't have anything on. Uh, your head. It's a it's a very lightweight device and I really enjoy this particular part of it where you can raise it up like a visor and look out and about. The control which I was going to describe is a lot of engineering in this device. You can save files, uh, you can turn off one of the eyes. Uh, there are many things you can do with this but I like to instead of focusing on the full capacity of what this device can do, I like to really focus on the simplicity. So the simplicity of this device is that you put it on your head, you have a power button, and you have one dial right here which controls the size. So I see a TV down there at the other end of the room. What I'm gonna do is, it's on pause, and the remote control's down there. So I gotta go get up. This could be a simulation of something at my house uh, where I wanna watch the TV, but the remote control's over there. So I gotta get up and uh, walk over and turn the TV on and then come back and sit down. And I can do that nicely with the visor up. Uh, I can walk wherever it is I wanna go. So I'm walking over here. I see the remote control. I'm gonna press play. Okay, walk back to my seat, which is approximately about 12, 15 feet away from the TV set. So I'm now I'm gonna take the visor of the glasses, the Eastside glasses and put them down. And I, now we have this pair to our iPad so that you can see what I'm seeing, but I don't know if it's doing it justice because it's casting the image onto here. There's no wire, we're just screen casting it onto here. You get an idea of what I'm seeing. So right now I'll keep my head still and I'll zoom in on that TV image and I'll just watch this TV for a little bit. At the combine, when you watch Tom, <laughs> you saw this tall, gangly looking kid Look like haven't ever seen a weight room. I can adjust the brightness. Ran a five two something. One of the slowest quarterbacks in the combine. Said he wowed me throwing the ball. There was some other guy that could shoot it, and he had just an okay arm. So I'm seeing a really nice image on that screen, and I can really enjoy watching the show for a long period of time. I noticed that when I talk, the screen moves a bit, but I'm going to keep quiet for a minute. You're going to go somewhere and learn a little bit about quarterbacking. You might as well go to the Bill Wall School of Quarterbacking. Okay, so that's one of the things that this particular product is good in using is watching TV. I'm going to walk over and just turn that TV off. Uh, you're going to see a little bit of a bad image on that screen. If you can just focus on me for a second. I'll push pause here. Okay, so watching TV with this product, walking around with this product is really nice and unique about it. I'm going to take the visor and put it right down again. And here I am looking out at a distance. So where does this come into uh, an application? So this is definitely to be used in school for the whiteboard, the blackboard. It's used in business for a PowerPoint or business meetings. Um, what you also can notice about this product is it looks good. It has a real nice spectacle look about it. It doesn't look uh, that foreign so it looks someone has said it looks now it looks more current so i'm looking about the room and it has a real nice cosmetic look about it and i can look at things all around i can see um, pictures on the wall um, i can see signage up and about um, i see different uh, lettering 
and um, objects in the room, all of these things which would be really difficult for me to see if I didn't have a magnifier on my head. So all I'm using is just one control on the left-hand side, which I showed you earlier, which allows me to <clears throat> zoom in and zoom out of wherever it is I wanna see. Here is the, uh, the clock. Maybe you've seen that clock reference before uh, at a distance. I'm gonna turn even more around the room here and um, I'm going to look at the logo on the wall, which we have shown in other videos. Uh, so it's, uh, it's really nice to kind of get up. I'm gonna put the visors above my head and uh, I see a sign on the wall that I wanna read. I'm just gonna turn the wire. Whoop, I'm not even connect. I can turn this way. So I'm gonna look over at this, at this signage right here. And you know, it's one of those posters at work which I ordinarily probably would not see, but now with this on, I can see really bright and um, the letters are really big and I can make that out all about. I can see the iceberg in the water and the, the letters behind it. Um, I can change the backgrounds as you can with a lot of different magnifiers, but um, I think the simplicity of this device is just really emphasized in uh, the power on and then that one zoom control. Uh, this is something that you have to try. It's a wearable that we uh, welcome you to come to New England Low Vision and Blindness and, um, and try it on. We're, our appointments are really thorough and we wanna make sure that you have a good showing of this device on your head. Uh, bring your different materials that you wanna read um, and uh, we'd be happy to show this to you uh, at a time that's convenient for you if you would just call the number at the bottom of your screen. Thank you. Hey guys, very important. Would you please help us out and click that subscribe button at the top right hand corner of your screen. Also, before you go, there's one more button to click. As you know, it's that very important gray thumbs up like button. Thank you.